caught me. Come on in. So it's Wednesday here at Andy Markets, Pizza Wednesday. So I've got some pizza. There's some barbecue chicken pizza and some thin ham and pineapple pizza. I'm sure I'm going to get people telling me that pineapple doesn't belong on pizza. I'm okay with it. You like your pizza, I'll like mine. The girls were home from school yesterday because they had a snow day. Lucy made cookies and Isabel made these nice muffins, so that'll be my dessert. Uh, also, I got some water. So let's talk about dry base. Week one, you really got to concentrate your designs toward your dry base. You might have a dry base that's put together. It might have all your wheels on it, your electronics on it, and you're moving around and you're really happy. Don't be happy yet. Weigh it down so that it's at least 130, 140 pounds because you got to figure the bumper add-ons there. So weigh it down so it's heavy. And then drive it on carpet, make sure your gear ratio is right. And then also, if you break it when it's way down and you're running into your defenses and those kinds of things, that's a good thing. You're breaking it early. You'd rather break it now than break it during week six or even during your event at the district or the regional competition. Something I do want to point out is from the University of Stonebrook. No, that's not the name of it. Sherbrooke. Yeah, I got it right. Sherbrooke in, in Montreal, Canada. They have a great video here showing an old chassis. This is the AM1 for you chassis with exposed wheels on the front and the back. It shows that chassis going over the different defenses. In this case, it's a six inch wheel chassis going over the, the rock wall. What they've proven here is a kit chassis is able to go over m many of these defenses without pneumatic wheels, without a track drive, even though the pneumatic wheels and track drive are, are hot, this still works. Thanks to these guys up in Montreal for, for putting this together. This is a great asset to the first community. We put it up on our Twitter page and our Facebook page, and maybe Brett can link it here, like down down here, maybe somewhere here. Here? I don't know. Anyway, it'll, it'll be linked so you can find it. We're working on some bumpers for the Rhino track drive. We'll have more on that later. This is the week not only you should be working on your drive base, but you should be getting in your first choice round two priority list and also your missing parts list from the kit of parts. So first wants to know if there's any parts missing from your kit of parts, you need to tell them. And I think there's a deadline for both of those. Do you know when they are, Andy? I should know. So um, let's see. First Inspires, right? Okay. So First Inspires, First Robotics. Gosh, there's a lot to go. Teams, Tim's is here. I think I might. I, hang on. Hang, I, I'm I, almost got it. Hang on just a second. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah. Keep uh -huh. keep keep looking for it, Andy. Hey, Jerry. Uh, yeah. When is the first choice priority list due? Uh, according to the website right here, it says 116 at noon. That's Saturday. Which website? First choice by AndyMark.com. Cool. Thanks, dude. <laughs> That's hilarious. Did oh, you? Hey. Uh, Sorry, it's 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 right here. We are, we already figured it's it out. It's on Tim's. Okay, another thing I want to point out is that everybody got this fabulous book in their kit of parts. All the first robotics teams got this in the in their great tote. This is a wonderful um, resource for all the first teams. First robotics behind the design, put together by Stephanie and Vince. It's I haven't even been through it yet, but I know a lot of people who have robots that are designed very well, and they're all in this book. So it's pretty, I'm looking forward to reading this thing, so if you have um, a minute or two, look into this. I think there's a website out there selling these for 40 bucks a piece, so this would be a great gift for anybody involved with FIRST. Thanks to Vince and Stephanie for putting this together. I'll see you on Friday. Good luck getting your drivetrains together, and um, have a good week. Is that really everything? That was a lot. I think. Saturday at noon? Yeah, this Saturday, the 16th, right there on the homepage. It shows homepage of what? First choice at anymark.com. Cool. It's not anymark.com. First choice. <laughs> <laughs>